guys. Thank you, thank you. You're probably wondering where my accent from. Obviously, Canada. <laughs> Just kidding. I'm from Russia. And I struggle with pronunciation. But my English broken a lot more than my bank account. God bless America! Yes. I'm an event planner. I'm planning party for children. I hate kids. But not mine, yours. But honestly, I love my job. It's such a joy, so incredible. Have you ever seen a drunk dinosaur? I have! <laughs> but best pay actors at the party, not the entertainers, but parents. Oh my gosh, you would never know what they actually think of you by the time they call in company asking their money back. I usually disagree with complaints, because what do you expect? A real dinosaur? <laughs> they don't have a work permit. <laughs> and PETA is a nightmare. <laughs> At every party, parents offer me a cake, like, like it's the best cake on earth. I'm like, thank you so much. I'll take cash. It's gluten-free. <laughs> <laughs> But I would never build successful business without support of my husband. Because he's so loving, he's so supportive, he's unemployed. He gave me no choice. I'm a very generous person. I never kept money for myself, according to slot machines. But I love playing in Vegas because of free drinks. Last time, I lost seven grand while waiting for my free drink. <laughs> but that's okay, because drinks cost nothing, except my child college fund. <laughs> I don't believe in God anymore. I believe in Google, it works faster. I struggle with a weight loss. And my husband really wants me to lose weight. He complains that my butt is too big. Oh. I'm saying, you know, sweetie, a lot of men paying to plastic surgeons to get their wives butt like mine. You got it for free! <laughs> right? Yeah. But of course I can lose a hundred pounds in one day, but divorce is expensive. <laughs> <laughs> he offered me to get m emotional support animal. I'm like, you know what? I just got one. It's in the kitchen. It's steak. <laughs> I'm a mother. My son in second grade. We have great school, but PTA is killing me. Every week they have something like reading week, spirit week, kindness week. Last week was a spirit week. And they ask children to dress up as the rock stars. How should I do that? Should I give him vodka? <laughs> Everybody thinks that Russians drink vodka, but it's not true. We're also doing drugs. <laughs> My son doing very well at school. I think it's because I cannot help him studying, so he figured better to be smart. <laughs> At doctor's appointments, they asking me if my son has any medical conditions, like asthma or allergy. What's a dumb question? We aren't that rich to be sick in this country! In my 20s, I decided to try a sex toy. So I ordered it online. It was before Amazon. So they sent delivery guy directly to me. I give him large bill, and he said, oh, I'm sorry, I don't have change. Let me run to grocery store to get change. Disappeared for an hour. I almost lost hope to see him again along with my money. But doorbell rings. It was delivery guy standing there with a huge bouquet of flowers and ice cream. And with a big smile, he said to me, I want you to know that you are so beautiful, you don't have to use that fake dick. <laughs> I'm like, thank you so much, it's so sweet of you, but where is my change? <laughs> this is my 